Today we have a recipe of a pickle okay okay and that too of a fish mm -hmm. and it is of a kingfish mm -hmm. so note the ingredients for kingfish pickle 500 grams kingfish marinated in half teaspoon turmeric powder 1 teaspoon olive oil and half teaspoon salt 8 to 10 red chilies 1 cup vinegar 2 parts garlic finely minced 5 to 6 green chilies finely minced 2 inch ginger finely minced, 2 tablespoon oil, half to 1 cup water and salt as per taste. We have taken half a kg of a kingfish okay. and we have taken only the middle pieces, mm -hmm. okay, the fleshy pieces. Okay. Okay. And uh, these have been uh, marinated in uh, turmeric powder, mm -hmm. 1 teaspoon of uh, olive oil. I okay. have uh, added half teaspoon of turmeric powder, mm -hmm. 1 teaspoon of olive oil okay. and little salt. Mm -hmm. And these are uh, staying in this marination for about uh, 2 hours. And the next step is to take uh, vinegar okay. and add uh, water. So we have uh, one cup of vinegar mm -hmm. and we'll be adding almost half to one cup of water. Okay. So now waste to vinegar te goni devo as to nirana sils beka. Ille to adar adar dash to nirana sils se desan ka. Yeah, almost half to one cup. Okay. Okay. And uh, this has to come to a boil mm -hmm. because this is a pickle and uh, it will stay for you know at least one to two months. Okay. That's why we are going to boil the water mm -hmm. and vinegar. Okay. So the vinegar water is uh, boiling. Okay. Okay. And uh, we'll set this aside hmm. to come to room temperature. Okay. And then in the meantime, we can uh, fry the fish. Mm -hmm. So this is going to be just a shallow fry. Hmm. Little oil, about a tablespoon or so. Dropping the Kingfish pieces in the hot oil. Okay, now with the salt matra in the So, I will the meat in the Okay, so we need to fry fish until crunchy. Okay. So the fish pieces have turned crunchy. Okay. You can see nice golden color mm -hmm. developed. Let us take them out on a plate and uh, allow the pieces to cool. Mm -hmm. So we are going to let the fish come to room temperature, okay. allow it to cool for some time mm -hmm. and in the meantime we can prepare the masala mm -hmm. and for masala we have only the long red chilies mm -hmm. okay okay we fry it okay. okay. and we will be grinding it along with the mm -hmm. vinegar water okay we will the vinegar and we will grind it with the vinegar and we will grind it Now our uh, fish also has come to room mm -hmm. temperature. Okay. We need to, you know, cut into small mm -hmm. pieces and uh, remove the bone. Okay. 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 Meanu thani thi dhag yadan na sanna kathori cut mar korbe ko. So mudle ni jo thani la bear paris be ko thi thina na. Yes. So you find uh, small thorns mm -hmm. in between. Okay. So just pick the thorns. Mm -hmm. This is the fish which has got uh, less mm -hmm. thorns. Okay, bare meat alla this oppa jasti mulu kare thoda. The even the angel meat alli sir pa kamy pramad dalle thoda. So haga ki upin kai madli ke kuda tumane sanaga kitte thoda. So make uh, small uh, bite size pieces. Okay. Okay, meat garan dalle san san dagi cut madli ready okay. madli thi dira. So yeah. masala kuda ready aagi thoda. Okay. Again madu thoda. Yeah, now the final step okay. is to make the pickle. Mm -hmm. We'll be using the same pan mm -hmm. which we used to fry fish. Okay. Add a little more oil. 
So, if you want to use this, you can use this as well. No, we have used about just 2 tablespoons of oil. Okay. So, this is one more speciality of this pickle. Mostly the pickles are made with excess oil as a preservative. As we are using vinegar here, there is no need of a lot of oil. Okay. Just a tablespoon or two is enough. So, once the oil becomes hot, we will slide in the chilies which are cut into you know small rounds okay then the finely minced garlic okay so illi enne kaayta bartidhage na avenu sanadagi katarisiruvanta hasi mensu mattu bedulina hakondidave so ishtu tanaka fry maadbeku ma'am adana just one or two minutes mm -hmm. until the you know the raw aroma of the green chilli and the garlic fades. Okay. We also have a finely minced ginger. Mm -hmm. So there it is another gikatar sirvanta shunti na kuda hakondi dira. Yi shunti matu bedulia parimala ne tumba chana gide. So orle parimala kordai dira. Very strong flavor, mm -hmm. isn't it? Okay. So this is enough. Mm -hmm. And now we'll uh, add the masala. Okay. As the masala dries up, you add the remaining uh, the vinegar water. Okay. Just uh, rinse the blender mm -hmm. and uh, add the water. We have added salt uh, while frying fish mm -hmm. as well. Now for uh, the masala, we'll add uh, salt. Okay. Keep on uh, stirring okay. until the masala becomes you know mm -hmm. slightly thick. Okay and uh, oil oozes out from the sides mm -hmm. and uh, keep stirring continuously mm -hmm. and see now you can see mm -hmm. oil oozing out okay now time to add uh, the fish pieces okay mix well so that the pieces of uh, fish Coated well in okay. masala. So, in the masala, it is made of the other thing, it is made of the So, in the next step, it will be Yeah, just for uh, you know, two to three minutes. Okay. So, on the main masala, it is made of the other thing, it is made of the other thing. So, it is made of the So, it is uh, almost uh, done now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anjal Mini na uppina kai, madalu beka gwa samagri kalo. Ainur gram Anjal Minu, e Anjal Mina na arda teacher macha arshina, bandu teacher macha olive enne, matu arda teacher macha uppinondi gesa varida beko. Yenter in the hatu kempu menasu, bandu cup vinegar, yeradu idi bedluli, either in the aru hasi menasu, yeradu incho shunti, arda cup niru, matu ruchigeta kastu uppo. Anjal Mini na uppina kai, madwa vidana. ಒಂದು ಪಾತ್ರೆಯಲ್ಲಿ ವಿನಿಗರ್ನ್ನು ತೆಗೆದುಕೊಂಡು ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ನೀರನ್ನು ಸೇರಿಸಿ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿ ಕುದಿಸಬೇಕು ಅದು ತಣ್ಣಿದ ಬಳಿಕ ಒಂದು ಮಿಕ್ಸಿ ಜಾರ್ ಗೆ ಕೆಂಪು ಮೆಣಸಿನೊಂದಿಗೆ ಈ ವಿನಿಗರ್ ಮಿಶ್ರಿತ ನೀರನ್ನು ಸೇರಿಸಿ ನಯವಾಗಿ ಗ್ರೈಂಡ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಬಳಿಕ 2 ಗಂಟೆಗಳ ಕಾಲ ಅರಶಿನ ಉಪ್ಪು ಮತ್ತು ವಿನಿಗರ್ನೊಂದಿಗೆ ಬೆರೆಸಿದ ಅಂಜಲ್ ಮೀನಿನ ಮಧ್ಯ ಭಾಗವನ್ನು ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಎಣ್ಣೆಯಲ್ಲಿ ಶಾಲು ಫ್ರೈ ಮಾಡಿಕೊಳ್ಳಬೇಕು ಫ್ರೈ ಆದ ಮೀನು ತಣಿದ ಬಳಿಕ ಅದರ ಮುಳ್ಳನ್ನು ಬೇರ್ಪಡಿಸಿ ಸಣ್ಣ ಗಾತದಲ್ಲಿ ತುಂಡರಿಸಿಟ್ಟಿರಬೇಕು ನಂತರ ತವಾದಲ್ಲಿ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಎಣ್ಣೆನ ಬಿಸಿ ಮಾಡಿಕೊಂಡು ಸಣ್ಣದಾಗಿ ಕತ್ತರಿಸಿದ ಹಸಿಮೆಣಸು ಬೆಳ್ಳುಳ್ಳಿ ಶುಂಠಿ ನಯವಾಗಿ ಗ್ರೈಂಡ್ ಮಾಡಿದ ಮಸಾಲೆ ಮತ್ತು ರುಚಿಗೆ ತಕ್ಕಷ್ಟು ಉಪ್ಪನ್ನು ಸೇರಿಸಿ ಅದು ಹದಗಾತ್ರಕ್ಕೆ ಬರುವಾಗ ಸಣ್ಣದಾಗಿ ತುಂಡರಿಸಿದ ಮೀನನ್ನು ಸೇರಿಸಿ ಎರಡರಿಂದ ಮೂರು ನಿಮಿಷಗಳ ಕಾಲ ಹಾಗೆ ಬಿಟ್ಟರೆ ಟೇಸ್ಟಿಯಾದ ಅಂಜಲ್ ಮೀನಿನ ಉಪ್ಪಿನಕಾಯಿ ಊಟದೊಂದಿಗೆ ಸವಿಯಲು ಸಿದ್ಧ